Hello my friends and welcome to my craft space. I have another project here for you today. I participated in a swap. Um, it was Poodle's Halloween Treat Box Swap from the Facebook group um, Coffee, Cake, and Crafting and it was hosted by Tiffany Crafting Like a Boss McGill here on YouTube. Uh, for those of you who don't know who Poodles is, she is Sam Donaldson, who is a Stampin' Up! demonstrator in the UK. And she has tons of boxes and bag tutorials on her channel. I'll leave a link to her channel in the description box below. She's really great. Check her out. For this swap, we had to make three of Sam's boxes. We had to make a tea light box, a 2x2x2 two by two by two box, and a 1x2x3 box. Uh, two of those boxes had to have a belly band. Uh, they all had to have Halloween paper, a 3D element, two additional elements, and a two from tag. And then we had to make um, another bag or box of our choice. And I chose to make a bag loop, um, which I made last year for the um, Halloween collaboration hosted by Mandy. From Mandy's Place here on YouTube. Um, and that is from Dawn's Stamping Thoughts, also here on YouTube. And I will leave a link in the description box below for that. Um, and we had to make a um, four embellishments. So this is it all packaged up. Put it in a little bag. I have this uh, wooden witch's hat and I painted it silver and stamped um, blue to you. I thought that was super cute. Oh, before I forget, this is the uh, paper I used. Where is it? There. This is um, Spooky and Sparkly. I found this at Tuesday morning, and I just love it. Um, I'm not the biggest Halloween fan. I like it. It's not my favorite. I, I really don't like scary or anything like that. And this black and white and silver paper was just perfect. It's really elegant and Halloween-y without being Halloween-y, if that makes any sense at all. <laughs> okay, so that was it packaged up. Okay, so this is how everything is packaged. These are my boxes. I will show those to you up close. Um, here's my topper. It's just a little crepe paper rosette with a purple witch's hat. These are my embellishments. I love the way these turned out. They're super cute. I was inspired by Yenny from Yenny Tales here on YouTube. Let's see if you can see those. So these are just little ghost embellishments. And then these are the other two. I thought they were so cute. And then this also has a little crepe paper rosette. And this has a little ribbon ghost. And uh, I got the ribbon ghost in the Halloween collaboration that I participated in last year. And these were made by Scrapbook Nut 2002, also here on YouTube. And I will leave her link in the description box below. And these are the boxes. This is the 2x2x2. Two by two by two. And there's the top. So I have a little wooden pumpkin that I painted silver with a little bit of orange bling. Um, some orange and black tulle that's really glittery. And um, a black crepe paper rosette. And this box folds flat. And then here is the two front tag that I made, and it matches the box. Next, uh, there's the belly band. This is the one, two, three box. This is the belly band. Um, it's some silver rickrack with some lime green ribbon wrapped around it. Um, there's a little tool. 
poof thing. I wouldn't call it a rosette. It's not really a rosette. And then this is uh, was a ring that I snipped off the plastic part and just hot glued that in there and painted that silver. This comes off. And then this is the paper that I used. With a little bit of bling down here. And then this is the two from tag for that. And I think this might be my favorite. This is the tea light box. It's a little teeny tiny box. You can actually fit quite a bit in there. Um, this is some silver and white spiderweb paper. And then there's a piece of purple tulle. Some like little spider webbing stuff. Uh, a little silver spider web sticker that I put on a dimensional and a little spider sticker here. And then the two from tag is teeny tiny. Oops, it's upside down. I just put little spiders on it in purple. I thought that was super cute. I love it. And then oh my bag. My treat bag. I'm not going to open it up, but there are lots of goodies in here. This is a little bag made out of an envelope. I really followed uh, Dawn's tutorial um, and how she decorated. Uh, I didn't use her exact products, obviously, but I followed it very closely, more than I did last year. I think last year I had um, a spider decoration and something. I don't even remember what I used last year. But I used some stripe paper from my collection. There's a silver spider web uh, die cut here. Uh, an oval here. This is Happy Halloween. There's a little um, candy corn sticker here. A little witchy hat here. And then some. These are all of the tool pieces and colors that I used throughout. And so that's it. That's all my all my swap stuff. I had a blast making everything and I hope my partners like everything. So thanks for watching and have a great day. Bye.